Om Shanti, a greeting of peace to all of you. When I see the tree, I see how when the tree is full of fruit, its branches bow down and the tree becomes, the fruits become accessible to all of us. Can I be the same? Can I have all the gifts from God that I've been blessed with, but also be able to bow down and share those gifts with all others with great humility, just as the tree does. And so humility is absolutely vital in this day and age because so many of the problems of the world are due to human ego. Ego of my position, ego of my possessions, ego of my property, ego of the people I think I can control in my life. There's a huge amount of ego. And of course, we see so many troubles in the world related to ego. But come the other way. Can I go deep within my inner being and realize that I am just a point of light? That's it. No possessions, no position, no people, nothing. I stand on my own, completely free. And yes, I'm connected with the Almighty because the Almighty is also that essence, that point of light. But also I'm connected with each and every human being. Each one is that eternal point of light. And in this awareness of I, the being of light, there is no ego, yet there is great self-respect. True humility matches up with great dignity and self-respect because when I don't know myself, ego destroys my own inner dignity. And in soul consciousness, awareness of the inner being with humility, I know that as a child of God, I'm blessed with all the gifts that God wishes to give me. And so recognizing my own value, I maintain my dignity and self-respect, but with interaction with all others, there's great humility. I'm able to treat each and every individual with respect, with regard. How different would the world be if we were to practice a little bit of humility each day and every day with everyone that we meet? Thank you. Om Shanti.